hey guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing well in today's video we are going to be looking at yet another premium footies player which is none other than lukeman now i know everybody would have got this guy because this guy is a part of the footy silver cup now if you play 10 games in the footy silver cup you'll be able to get this wonderful player 95 rated striker lukeman premium footy card so without any further ado let's look at his stats his play styles his attributes all of his things and then we'll put him in a squad and see how good he actually is in game i am really excited for this card i'm not gonna lie i am really excited for this card so first off you can play him in three other positions apart from striker which is right wing right mid and center forward now right wing and right mid is really good i don't know how many of you guys play center forward if you guys do play center forward so he can be played as center forward as well he has good pace and he has good dribbling for it so gg in that dish uh, in that area and now i don't know how many of you guys know he plays for syria as well so looking at his skill move and his weak foot five star five star which is insane guys five star five star for a free card this is actually a free card playing 10 games is not hard even if you don't win anything you just play 10 full games you'll be able to complete a lot of things and it is easy it is easy so yeah and looking at his stats his attributes in details he has 95 pairs 94 shooting 97 dribbling and 90 passing with 86 physical guys now i would say one thing his dribbling looks really really nice he has 98 dribbling he has 95 ball control he has 98 agility all these dribbling stats are looking so good and even when it comes to pace you guys can see he has 97 acceleration he's high he has 93 sprint speed now once we put him into the dream he'll be getting plus four sprint speed as well so 97 pace it'll be upgraded to which is really nice and his shooting is also looking really good 92 short par 98 attacking position 97 finishing i'm not gonna lie like i said i'm really really excited for this card he has 94 curve as well 91 short pass 90 long pass even if you're using him at right mid or right wing right he's gonna be really good because of these stats and uh yeah he has 91 stamina 92 jumping 95 heading accuracy i don't know if we'll be able to text test his heading accuracy and stuff but he has those he has power shot plus he has a uh, finish shot which is one i usually use a lot he has technical plus he has trickster plus and then relentless plus so these are actually pretty decent playstyle pluses first touch flare uh, incisive pass finesse power header and then dead ball these are all his play styles not the playstyle pluses so he has a bunch of decent plays i would say the play styles look more interesting than the playstyle pluses i'm not gonna lie so yeah let's actually look put him in a team and see how he plays i am going to be playing him as striker so this is going to be interesting so we'll be testing out his pace his shooting and his dribbling because we're going to be playing him um, uh, as a striker passing usually we'll test out short pass even if it's a striker so we'll see actually how the card is in game guys okay this is how the squad looks i am playing look i am playing him at right striker because he has five star five stars so his preferred foot is right if i'm not wrong and since he has five star weak foot i'm i'm guessing this is a pretty decent position to play him at and yeah this is a formation i am actually testing on some of these players as well so yeah hopefully we'll be able to play really well with lukeman now let's hop on to a game real quick guys and tomorrow's video is gonna be an 85 times 10 pack opening i think i have a bunch of 85 times 10 and then apart from that we have a bunch of 84 times 10 we have some 83 times 20 and stuff so we'll be opening all those for footage team 3 and seeing how we actually i mean how what, if we can pack anything good because it's been a while since we packed uh footies card so yeah we'll try how it is and see how if we can pack anything good i'm not gonna lie his acceleration feels a bit too slow you know he has really good uh, short pass he has good dribbling as well his, his curve is not there his shooting is good his dribbling is good doesn't feel like he has 97 acceleration though i don't know what is happening over there maybe it's because i'm playing him slow could be the reason Ooh, that is a good tackle tackle i don't know why i move into the left and right when i'm printing this is one bad habit with me i keep moving left and right 
Ooh, Harry. How is Harry already injured? Guys, I have been playing with him on the low key after I showed you uh, guys how he's been. Um, I'm not gonna lie, acceleration is a bit underwhelming. It doesn't feel like he has 97 acceleration. He has good dribbling, he has good everything else, but he has good shooting as well. His shooting is also pretty decent. But it doesn't feel like he has acceleration 97, you know. His sprint speed is good. Don't get me wrong on that. His sprint speed is good. His acceleration doesn't feel like it's 97. It's more like a 93, 94 vibes I'm getting. And I have been playing with Kudus as well. I know many of you guys have been watching the Kudus player review. He's actually pretty good, you know. Kudus at scam is, uh, is actually pretty good. Uh, don't play him as the right wing player. I think that is where he was uh, initially released. Don't play Kudus as right wing. If you guys want to play him at cam, please do play him as... Oh my god. If I would have got chipped by an AI, I would have just closed the game. Not gonna lie. Look at this. Look at his acceleration. It doesn't feel like his acceleration is 97. But look at the sprint speed now. The sprint speed is really good. And the shooting is actually pretty decent as well. Now in Rivals... I don't know how he's gonna play, you know, I'm not gonna lie, in Rivals, if you don't have good uh, attributes in pace, you're gonna get beat. But at the same time, you don't have to rely on just one striker. If you're playing a formation which has a left wing and a left a right wing, you guys can whack on Lukman for some time and, you know, get the pace of the game down so that the opp opponent is like, this guy is too slow and then... You can just, you know, wow. Like I said in Kudus' player review, his shooting is so horrible, guys. Kudus' shooting is so horrible. I've been saying this even in the Kudus player review. His shooting is so bad. Uh, his acceleration is very, 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 you know, concerning. So I would say use him as your... Either use him in the end, uh, like later half of the game, around last 20 minutes, just to get through the game. Or use him in the first 45 and then just swap him out um, he's a he's a decent player he's a decent player to have in the sub or in the first team just to like a uh, rotational squad rotational player other than that i wouldn't say he's crazy if his acceleration was good i would 100 percent suggest you guys using him because if that acceleration was not that weak i would 100 percent suggest you guys using lukeman and even if your play style is like different you know you guys can try lukeman and see if he suits your play style, this is my opinion, how I feel about Lokman when I play my game. So he is actually pretty decent, except for the acceleration. It says 97, but it doesn't feel like 97 for me. So yeah, let me know in the comment section how you guys felt Lokman is. And maybe if it was just my glitch or glitch for me, I don't know. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, which is going to be a pack opening. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, take care, stay safe, stay motivated and keep smiling guys. Bye-bye.